If you want to enjoy the festive season in Ghana, then lorry terminals or trotro stations, as they are known locally, just like this one here in Accra, are a set of points. Because for those who spend most of the year in the city, it is time to spend the holidays with relatives and loved ones in the village. Of course, churches too have their peak seasons, as worshippers all over the country are filling the auditoriums of the various churches. And what would a holiday be without a beach day? Across the country, families and young people will spend time picnicking and having a drink. So you see, there is enough room for everyone to make merry this Christmas season. Christmas is a big deal in Cameroon, but the build up to Christmas is even bigger. This is the period where a lot of people want to achieve their life goals. So many people want to get married just before Christmas, while others want to move to a new property. African families are large, so individuals save up a lot of money, not just to buy stuff for their immediate family members, but also for a long list of extended family members, so everyone can have a happy Christmas celebration. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas in my country, Namibia. Just like here in Germany, the Christmas lights are up in the capital, Windhoek, and the malls are decorated with different ornaments and so many lights. But the festivities don't happen in the capital, Windhoek. Families are gearing up to travel to the villages or farms to visit the grandparents or relatives and enjoy some quality time together. There will be so much food, salads, some proper meat and braai. Don't forget the music, of course. That is the Christmas that I miss. Christmas in Kampala is mainly about merrymaking and no one understands that better than the business community. Christmas time is about discount. All businesses want to maximize the opportunities of families shopping for the festive season. But also, Christmas in Kampala is like an exodus as families travel to the countryside to celebrate together. But anyway, it all goes back to one thing in Uganda. Christmas is about food to many of us. Christmas without a big meal is not worth a name. And here in Lagos, Nigeria, adorning places with decorations such as these ones are a major part of Christmas celebrations. This is what Christmas looks like. This is how many Nigerians, especially in Lagos, start their Christmas celebrations. Many Nigerians come to enjoy the beauty of these decorations, which will be here even a little after Christmas. With the stress in the country and the hustle and bustle of life, a little enjoyment of these decorations will brighten our lives and it's not a bad idea. Ah. 